All right, I'm going to show you something different today. So I've just created a new virtual machine. And when I went to start the virtual machine on Power Open, I got the error message that says the VMware workstation unable to open the kernel device on that specific location. The operation completed successfully, but it says whether did you reboot it after installation and it's failed on the power on. So this is for a reason um, that we have a file here in the VMware configuration. So I'll talk, if you go into the installation directory, uh, you see your VMX file. So just go to your VMX file, right? And open that through Notepad, right? Or whatever the best uh, WordPad editor. So I'll just open up here. So if you go in here, you see VMI, VMCI 0.present, it's configured to true. Just change this one from true to false. So I'm just going to uh, copy a false statement somewhere, maybe. Uh, oh, okay, there's no false, so I'm going to just type false and save this file. So make sure that you close this document, um, the VMware, so we don't want that to open up. So save this, right, close it, and close this. Go back to your VMware, open the VMware Workstation 16. So the one that I'm using, VMware Workstation 16, you can see it's running on VMware Workstation 16. Right, now power it on. You can see the virtual machine is beautifully powered on. So I'm just installing the operating system and it works perfect. So that's just um, simple change just modify that, it works perfect.